Hey guys, today I wanted to share with you an incredibly easy way to create custom thumbnails for your YouTube channel using Photoshop. Now there's two major factors that are going to determine how your images come out. The first is the project's properties and then the second is how you save the file when it's done. So let's start by opening up a new document in Photoshop. So we'll go to File, New. Now this is the first step in ensuring that you have uh, a high resolution image. Okay. Now YouTube's preferred settings are 1280 by 720, which is considered HD. Uh, so for now, we're gonna name our project test. Make sure your width is at 1280 and your height at 720. For web stuff, I usually keep my resolution at 72 PPI or pixels per inch. We'll hit okay. And now we just wanna design something real quick. So I'm gonna go to the polygon tool. I'll add a quick polygon. I'm gonna zoom out. And let me change the color right quick. So I'm gonna change the stroke color to this light blue. And then I will change the fill color to this deep blue. There we go. Kind of move this around. Actually, let me rotate it. And then just move it down. Somewhere in there should be good. And now I'll just take a Photoshop image that I have on my computer. Put that in. Size it down a little bit. There we go, it's looking pretty good. I'll zoom back in and let's add some text. Let's do custom thumbnail. And change the color since final white doesn't show up very good. the size of that and also now the design is not what I'm really focused on in this tutorial that's not the point I mean what you do as far as your design goes is entirely subjective I mean that's that's on you I'm not talking about that as much as I am talking about setting up your project settings and then exporting it. so say we were happy with this design and we wanted to go ahead and save this We'll go to File, Save As. If you want to change the name, you can. I'm going to leave it as Test, and I'm going to leave it saving to my Pictures folder. You want to go down here to Format, and you want to change it to JPEG. And JPEG files are usually a little bit more compressed, so it's a smaller file size. Uh, YouTube does have a two megabyte uh, maximum as far as the file size. So if you start doing things like PNGs, and it's really elaborate, sometimes you may actually uh, exceed that. So you want to save this as a JPEG. You save it. it, already exists. I'm going to go ahead and hit replace just for grins and then OK. So now if we go back to YouTube, you got this little button here. Once your video is uploaded, uh, you have the option to create a custom thumbnail. So we'll click that and we'll go to our pictures and then mine saved for whatever reason down here click open and now it's going to upload and you should see right up here in just a second it should pop up so when you hit publish it'll then save your custom thumbnail to there so that's it guys I uh, hope you found this helpful if you liked the video be sure to give it a thumbs up also don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching